It's that time of year, ladies and gentlemen. It's that time of year for Tarkov. Are you ready? Season 8 is here, ladies and gentlemen, of Ragnar Riches, and it also includes a Streets of Tarkov, which is going to be such an exciting, exciting time. I'm very excited for all this. It's been a while. We've been talking about this for a very long time, and it is finally here. And of course, we're going to be doing this venture together, as always. Uh, name wise, we're going to go with Half Men Season 8, because we always go with the season and let you guys choose the name, which this season we'll be doing on Episode 3. So. Episode 1, make sure you go through and figure out the best name that you think that we should make the account. Put it down below, down below in the comments, and of course, whoever's got the most upload up likes will have the name choice. So be ready for that on episode 3. Now, we gotta choose. We wanna go Bear or we wanna go Usec this time? I think last time we went Usec for season 7, I'm pretty sure it was, it was that. Uh, but tra tradition wise, I feel like we've always like gone bare for ourselves. So we're going to go bare and I think we're going to go, we're going to go Alex. Then we're going to go Alex. Why not? Let's go with the look there. That seems like a good look, look for season eight. We're going to make it happen. Now, for those that are just joining us on this very long adventure into season eight, and you've never seen a Rag to Riches video before and you don't know exactly what's going on, um, let me explain something to you and exactly how it works. So, Rag to Riches is very easy and fast to explain. Basically, all these items that I get inside this alpha container and also our stash here, I delete every single thing. We start with nothing. We start with completely zero balance of, well, because it's decent items to start with at the beginning. And we basically try to build up and see how far we can get into the account. Now, I'm not going to destroy your eyes with me deleting items over and over. What I'm going to do real quick is delete all these items, and I'm also going to examine every single item in the traders, and then we will begin. All items deleted, nothing is left for us to use. And the only last thing we need to do now, since we've hit level 2, is we need to accept some tasks. So we're going to get Debut, we're going to get Therapist, Mechanic, and of course, get Introduction as well. Now, uh, the other thing too for everyone, we always used to do like a like mini side task for ourselves to try to aim for. Uh, I don't think Kappa's going to be in the exact uh, thought process right now. Honestly, this year's just, I don't know yet. We're going to kind of go through and see how we want to have like the subtask and have a good time. So just keep an eye out for that right now. Uh, my only goal is to just learn Streets of Tarkov and have a lot of fun with that one right now. That's kind of the, I guess, the side goal for it, because it seems like a lot of fun. And speaking of uh, Streets of Tarkov, that's where we're going today. Because I try to traditionally go with the newest map out for every single life, and well, Streets of Tarkov is here, and we are going to go in there with nothing and see if we can come out with something. So, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's start Season of 8 of Rag to Riches on Streets of Tarkov. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Uh, I kind of have an idea of somewhat the layout of the map, but not a ton. Uh, so we'll see, see how that goes. Now, I did change up a small couple of rules for this season, and that's uh, pretty much the alpha container can be used for whatever the heck I want. I've gotten so many seasons now where I've only allowed keys and, and, and med supplies in there, but, you know, I figured let's change it up a little bit this year. Let's see what kind of uh, action we can get. Close the store, please. Thank you. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, also, real quick, if you guys are, are new to the channel, it's first time watching, make sure you join into the Discord. The link will be down below in the description. I already got a gun. This is great. And I also got bullets, too. Nice. So, yeah, if you've never, uh, if you've never had a place to play, come on over to the Discord. Awesome people over there. Uh, really good people that will be able to help you out and uh, have a good time. So, I'm actually going to drop one of those. Take the paid. Take that for now. Unload that. Let's load. Oh, wait. Is this not the same? Oh, it's the 45 rip. Oh, definitely not the same then. Five rounds in a dream. We could make it happen. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Get screwdriver. Oh, an access card just update. Do the stuff we can find. Uh, really, the only thing I really want to focus on getting, obviously, is going to get. Rude. I'm talking. 
Uh, I want to try to get myself some some armor if I can, some bags and a, um, a rig. It pretty much go from there. I'm just gonna do this for XP wise. Why not? And while we're kind of quite alone right now, let's see what we can get. And I don't know. I just took a streets to be kind of a fun one to do. We you know we we uh, we always try to go with the tradition of playing the one that's just come out and. I never really, uh, <laughs> well, I never really say I'm gonna have success in, in things, so we're just pretty much just go with the flow and see what happens. I'm almost gonna probably regret not having that. Because something tells me I'm gonna have a struggle finding those, so like, real later on. Money! I don't need money right now, though, but thank you. Uh, UV lights. Now, I do have a map of Tar uh, Street Tarkov up, so that way I'll be able to kind of know where I'm going. I don't exactly know the whole layout, but hey, it comes with time. Ooh, keck tape. Let's take the keck tape just because it sells for a little more money. Oh, am I stuck? Oh, I'm bugged. Oh, it's just laggy. <laughs> I don't even want to. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Well, of course, with any new map, you're going to have this problem. Oh, can't break into that. Okay. Can't break into there. No big deal. Okay, we got a pistol. We got some lag. I love it. Open the door, sweet. Got vodka. No, we're not starting this now, Tarkov. I'm not taking any any of your vodka right now, okay? But I appreciate the offer anyway. It's very nice you to offer me a drink right now. But I'm uh, focused on the game. Oh, this is not me, by the way. If you're if you're seeing this, it's definitely uh, <laughs> it's definitely Tarkov. What if we crouch through it? Can we make it through it? Probably not. Ooh, ammo. Let me examine at least. Ooh, wow, that's really good ammo right off the bat. Let's drop the spark plug. We'll take that for now. Well, if we find an AK, we'll be able to use that. I'm, it's like I can almost reach it, but I can't. Oh, the door can't even open. Well, that's the thing. Okay, we'll see here. We got a bag. We got some random loot scattered around here. Nothing else that we can really use. Uh. Oh, boy. <laughs> this, this is a lot of fun. I wonder if anyone else is having this struggle. I'm sure they are. I can't be the only one that's having that struggle. Just want to keep moving. I want to get stuck at a weird spot. What are our extracts anyway? I should probably look at that real quick. So we got Damage House. We got Kill Mode Street. We got Evacuation Zone. All right. Oh, this is not good. I'd rather have these spikes on the side of a building. Be a little more safer, of course. I'm on. I'm on. Just gonna just, we're just going to chill for a second. Also, if you guys have played Streets already, what do you think of it? What's your thoughts on it? Is it something that you're 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 excited to keep playing, or is it kind of like a uh, yikes? This is kind of feeling weird at the moment, but we'll see how it goes. Kind of kind of thing. Ooh. Okay. Okay. That's a thing. <laughs> we got some more paid. We got bleach, filing cabinets. Uh, I'm really just trying to see if I can get some keys too over here. Since I don't know if there's any like specific places for like ammo crates and whatnot, uh, we're just gonna keep searching for items. Oh, an SSD right away. Okay. Uh, I'll drop the rip because I don't think I'm gonna find a 45 weapon anytime soon. So we'll just take that for now. Got a light bulb. Oh, I can't say no to a light bulb. Give me the light bulb. Those things are gonna be like fifty thousand uh, uh, rubles right now. They're expensive. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. All right. Well, I'm getting out with that. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely gonna be interesting trying to find the uh, trying to find the exits because I don't know where I'm at right now. I'll have to find some landmarks of of areas that I'm at. Maybe we can piece it together, but as of right now, I have no idea. Okay, that opens up. Oh, it's like a back of a restaurant. Okay, let's close that for now. Oh no, let's close that for now. Looks like that's where I could have came into, so I'm not going to worry about that. I'm going to look in on everything. Energy water is looking okay for now. I just got to make sure if I, if I see any food, I need to grab some.
And I gotta remember, I only have five shots, so I need to be very cautious. Nothing inside there. This is like a car dealership or like uh I don't even know. I'm hoping to find a gun, like a bigger gun, these dead scabs, like right here. Whoa, look at that. A bunch of shooting already out in the street. But we're gonna try to stick to the, to the outskirts. Nothing in there. Actually don't know what that was, so that was interesting. <laughs> Tarkov doing Tarkov things. How about that? We'll just we'll call it that. Come on, give me another gas analyzer or, or something. I will drop this paid in a heartbeat. I just want this paid because I can get myself a sailor. Ammo. Ooh, Hulachi. Is there any 9 by 19 9 by 18 I think this is all PPT. Direct a love bulb for just a second. Oh, nope. This is 9 by 18 Yeah, it's 9 by 18 Never mind. Get rid of it. Don't need it. I'll take my light bulb instead. Make sure I didn't miss anything here. Is that a key? No, that's a pen. That's a pen half. No, that's not. Definitely not a key. Okay, let's just keep moving. Is there any rooms in here I can go into? Maybe they have like a map of the town square or something. We've had that before where there's just like a bunch of... Like maps kind of like reserve how they have their maps just sitting randomly around the area. Maybe we get lucky with that. Check up the second floor. What do we got? Can we go in there? Nope. I wonder what kind of keys there are for this place. I'm sure there's got to be quite a bit of them. Augmented. Oh boy. Got some stuff there. Trying to do as much searching as I can while also trying to not lose my energy too much. Because that's the only, only really unfortunate thing is if I lose too much energy, then I have to sit out for a while. Oh, that worked out a lot better, I thought. Just more of that ammo. Okay, let's do this then. Drop the paid for a second. Let's take. Why, why are you telling me I can't take it? Do I have to have this as a free slot? Oh! Interesting. You can't put the boxes in there. Why would you not put the box? The box? That seems kind of odd. Huh. The more you know. Okay. Well, good thing I figured that out now versus later. I've been trying to drag it there for like hours. Like, why can't I drag it? Alright. No guns. No boxes. In hindsight, this is probably a terrible place to come for a weapon. I won't lie. This, oh, ooh. This will sell better than most. Okay, maybe I'll just don't worry about the paid. Uh huh. Okay. What else we got? I think I need that for a task for Peacekeeper another line of the road. Or we need all the injectors, so why don't we grab that instead? Ooh, 9 by 19 Nice. Okay, we gotta drop this. Drop this. We'll just we'll grab those in a second. I need to unload this. I need to unload this. And let's get that load up. Cool. We got some extra ammo. That's good. That's good. I'm probably not gonna carry the extra small bullets, but um, yeah, let's not let's not worry about it. And the other thing we're gonna probably do is go out to the street, like right here at the beginning. See if there's any dead scabs along it. Let's see if we can get anything good. Let's get some refilled on drinks and everything. Pineapple juice. Delicious. 
Well, then I kind of have an idea what that's. So that room's all. That's nice. I'm looking at the map and I'm like, okay, I don't know where I'm at, but I have a feeling I'm like in between these two spots. Maybe I'm here. I don't know. It's very strange. Very strange. The humpback. Is there any more food around here? There's more ammo. Ooh, a teapot. I didn't even see the teapot. Just sitting there. You know, we'll worry about... So we're obviously going to sell for more. We'll take the gas analyzer. We'll take this. What's this? What ammo is this? BP runs. Okay, let's just remember where all the stuff is at because we can come back for it. If we can get a backpack or a vest or something, we can come back for all this stuff. A chicken. That's a sniper. Ooh. Long gun? Long gun, please. Come on. Big gun. Big gun. Big gun. Nope. Although, not a bad item to have, but I know we can get that from the trader, so not a huge deal. I'm guessing this is going to be a task area at some point. Just kind of gives out that vibe. This is going to be BT ammo. Oh, really good ammo, too. Okay. We need to do a little bit incognito searching. See if we can get ourselves over to a dead body. Anything in the kitchen? Get PRS. Not good ammo at all. Can't open that door. There's nothing inside there. Okay, not a huge deal. All right. Wish I could open that crate. So much of military stuff here, though. Granada, maybe? Oh, oh. <laughs> Definitely a Granada. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm going to remember where that's at. Although I may need to use that to kill somebody, so... Yeah, soon TM. TMO, what other ammo we got here? I'm also just, I want to get as much XP while we're in here too. Nothing in there. Red the bull. Can't open any of those doors. Okay, where, where is this leading me? I don't... <laughs> I'm following a hallway, which I don't know where it's going to go, which is like the excitement. There's a dead body at the end I'm seeing. Helmet? No, just a bunch of drinks. Okay, this is literally a dead end. I don't think... Oh, no, you can go out the store. Nice. We can go out the store here and we can get the heck out. We got oats. We got some ammo. Oh, it's easy to do. another staircase. Okay. This is where we just started. So, we're okay, we're literally in the same back alleyway. I have a feeling I know where we're at. Which... Exit wise, we got the dang, we have a lot of time inside this place. But it, then again, it is a very large place to go. So we got damage house, we got evacuation zone, and we got the street. Which I apparently can't go that way. I need a flare. We got a sewer entrance. I have to go to the damage house, which is like one street across. And the evacu evacuation zone is probably going to be the best spot for me. Yeah, we're going to have to take um, a couple of streets. I was going to go down below. I was, but I want to see if there's maybe a backpack. Nope. I'm just going to try to smash that door. Just like how you guys are going to smash the like button in this video. Let's go for like uh, 2,000 likes. I, I always set my, my bar very low. Of course, I'm going to probably set it high. And I'm going to be <laughs> too high, but we'll see. I want to say 2,000 likes. Let's see if we can smash that. Anything in here? We'll, we're going to check this one out, and then we're going to get the heck out. Probably gonna have to come back to the stuff anyway. I'm just also seeing if I can find a dead body or two on the ground. Which I do not see yet. Let's check for a key. Bunch of stuff. Bunch of stuff. No clothes. Okay, no clothes I can look through here. This is a very strange place. Oh, is this kind of like, uh, I forget what they call it, like the, like the hidden areas. I don't know, but it's a very weird children's room, and I think I'm going to keep moving. Oh, 
Okay, so we had like a military area here. Nothing there. We do have a crate. Helmet? Helmet? Helmet. Heck yeah. We got ourselves a helmet. We're gonna have a bunch of ammo. We got PP ammo. We got PS or SP ammo, which are both bad. I didn't actually check this, and I know there's a chance for a gun in here, too. Matches! Hey! CPU fan. I know CPU fans and all that are probably good trades right now, but we're going to keep moving on. Check for medical supplies. I do not see any. Dead Scava, what's up, bro? You got anything good for us at all? Oh, you got, you got a lot of stuff, actually. Maybe a gun right here? Nope. Oh, <laughs> look at you. Hello, Mr. PM Pistol. Uh, we're going to come back to this guy. Because the PM Pistol would not be a bad, bad thing to hold on to early. Granted, again, we are we are running with just the alpha, uh, alpha container and also the small stash. So there is that other like downsides that obviously we can only carry so many things at a time. Which means we're going to be using a lot of bags and whatnot to keep holding a bunch of items. I need all that stuff. I like every single bit of it. That's why I need a backpack. It just keeps going. Oh, I know. Is it blocked here? It is. Okay. Oh. Seven, six, two rounds. I'm just looking for any type of gun. Do you like me enough, Tarkov, that you can give me a gun? No, you don't. That's okay, though. Oh, it's a mounted gun here. Oh. That may come in use later. Okay. That yeah, that'll actually come in a lot of use. I know there's a like fighting going. On. Smash. No, no, this is okay. This will actually come in a lot of use. If I know there's a player uh, like coming at me from that direction, we'll use that instead. But hopefully by then we'll have a weapon. We won't have to worry about doing that type of stuff. So I know this is the staircase we originally came up. Let's get outside. Quickly look for like a dead body or two. And just grab the stuff and we can come back through here and grab some of that, that, that nicer stuff that we can actually use. This is the door we came through. Playground set. I remember this from the trailer. I know, okay, I know exactly where we're at. Yes, I, I know exactly where we're at. The only problem is now is I gotta find a body. Or find a scab, you know? But hey, we do have rounds that we can actually use against them, so... This will be a little bit helpful. I don't know what that is, but it scared me for a minute. I love this though. I love the, the urban environment. It's such a fun atmosphere to fight in. I'm sure there's a bunch of loot above me, behind me and all that, but I'm going to take it slowly. More stuff in here I can loot to, but again, I need a more room to put all this stuff in. Okay. I don't want to search anything else until I find that backpack or if we decide to get out and come back in. This feels like a streets day. I feel like it's going to be a streets day for sure for us. I'm sure those that have never seen Streets of Tarkov yet are probably very excited about that, and so am I. Because I'm like, heck yeah, if I can get some action in this, let's do it. Alright, that's all blocked off. That looks like the grocery center that I need to go to. Problem is, is figuring out how the heck to get, uh... Get through these buildings. <laughs> I 
That's a problem. That shouldn't kill me. Oh, he was above us. I heard the jump and I'm like, okay, he's around me somewhere. Oh, so unfortunate. <laughs> Left arm. He had a, I'm pretty sure he had a SKS he got us with us. Yep, SKS. Dang it. Now, good thing it doesn't cost us anything to get uh, patched up and whatnot. Energy water still looking okay. <laughs> we have a teapot that's no use to us, but we can sell for money. And we also got a gas analyzer we can sell for money because obviously it has got to be found a raid. Dang. I saw all the light in the corner and then just. Yeah, unfortunately, I should. I think I should have just wait for him to come push us, but not a big deal. It's expected to die in these type of rounds, but we did learn a lot. We got a lot of information on streets, so which was nice. But I think we're gonna jump back in there and uh, see if we can come up with again. Try one more time, and maybe we get some nice luck from it. Okay, oh boy, we got some lag going on again. I've got to wait because I just cannot move. Okay, we good now? Ish, maybe. I don't like being on the open and lagging, I'll be honest. Not the funnest thing in the world. And I, was, I believe the lag is just, just people like loading in. So we just gotta give it a second let people load in and then we can pretty much keep moving. I gotta find a weapon though. Find a weapon. It's our, our goal again. Not sure where the last guy killed us. I looked back to the footage and it just pretty much there no info. I was like, okay. But not a big deal. I'll take the ammo for now. Anything, anything at all I'll take. I'll even take an AK in a box if you got one of those. Package it up, I'll take it with me. Getting some lag again. Okay. I think there's a body over here. Ooh, actually, it's not, it's, that's like a... Ooh, that looks like a good place to actually go. Oh, not, this is not a good place to go. Stand still. Maybe. There's going to be struggles uh, the first day of Tarkov, of course. Anyway, doesn't matter what wipe, it's always been a bit of a fluff order at the beginning. Done? Oh, battery. Wow. All right. Well, someone's going to get lucky with that because obviously I don't have a backpack, so I can't carry all that. <laughs> uh, ooh, I can enter this. Nice. Jump over this. Somebody is shooting. Oh, I hear AI. Gotta go. Gotta go. Oh, there's one literally right there. Yep. I hear ya. You don't like me. I'm, I'm getting the hint on that one. <laughs> uh, for those of you that don't know about the uh, the AI, if you're not uh, using any weapons, uh, it's just kind of like an anti... Uh, rat method, which obviously I, I actually enjoy the idea of having it, but when you're doing challenges like this, you can make it pretty difficult. But yeah, if you're not holding a weapon, I have no weapon. There's a guy that's just AFK right there. Please, Tarkov, there's a man right there. Done. Only two spots. Right here, right here, right here. Gotta keep going. We got some cool glasses to make us look cool while we're doing all this, though. Oh. You're missing. You're missing. You ain't got a shot. You're losing everything. Oh, that's a player right in front of me. Oh! Oh! It's a prank! It's a prank! It's just a prank, bro. I didn't mean to come this way. Maybe the AI will find that one guy that you saw that was just sitting in the corner. I definitely will remember where he's at, though. And if we find a gun, we'll go back and take care of him. If he's not moving by then. If he's moving by then, well, then I'm screwed. Oh, we got some chances. We got some chances. Oh. It's armor. I can't say no. Weapon? Oh, dang it. 
Listen, I'm ill though. Okay, we got some protection, that's good. Door? No door. Uh, I don't think I can do much here. Oh, is, is there food here though? I was just looking at my energy, my water is going down pretty fast. I gotta get some some of that in me. That's gotta be a, a pretty high priority right there if I wouldn't keep going. I mean finding armor is really good. That's uh that's a it's a very good addition. However, kinda need the other tools to keep going. Can't open these doors, nothing up here anyway. Okay, now it's just something that's broken. <clears throat> Not a big deal. I'm hoping by me like kind of like weaving back and forth that there's a chance that these other players are gonna kill a scab or two. Which will allow us to just, you know, go behind them and pick up the gun. Granted, it all depends if they're going to actually pick it up or not. Thought I hear somebody, someone behind me. There probably is, but I got to keep moving forward. Don't want this bath galley anymore. There's a lot of oh. oh, that's unfortunate. I don't know if that guy actually saw us from that, but we'll, we'll keep moving forward. That's the only thing I can do. I, I just gotta keep moving. He's right in front of us, but we'll see if he's gonna pass. going that way. Now looking good in the energy front. open or am I just screwed? Hey, those ones are on roofs. I don't see anyone in front of me. I lied. I'm right there. 
Get my energy back. No! <laughs> See underneath them. Oh, I found something. Hey, hey, this is not bad. Let's go hide for a minute. You leave any guns? Oh, you sneaky little people. Leave me some ammo or a gun or something. Take the bandage. Take that. Take that as well. Okay. I have no idea where I'm at, by the way. I just know that I'm at somewhere. Oh, cool. He had food and water on him. Huge W right there. He had a pistol. This man was using a pistol. I see why they took it now. Javi, <laughs> let's just say it's a good thing you had that grenade on me, I'll be glad be dead. I'm just gonna literally take everything right now. Found dead players, but I haven't found dead scabs. I think I'm at the statue. That's the cinema right there. I'm quite certain that's the cinema. That's the statue right there. What's my exits? I gotta be pretty close, right? Sewer River's gotta be off to my right. Actually, it's gonna be that way. I got the underpass. Don't ask me why I said underpass like that, but I'm pretty sure it's pretty far away. So, unfortunately, I want to exit. I gotta go that way. Oh, <laughs> I'm throwing scabs on my butt. Nope, nope. I don't know what you just said, but you're gonna leave me alone. I gotta stay ahead of him. He'll, he'll stop for a second, then he'll continue, basically. As you can see. Back to the dead bodies again. Got up pretty much everything I can get from them. I'm gonna go through here, see if there's anything in, inside these buildings maybe that is useful. There's a scab there, scab to my right. Oh, I don't hear him. Hey, you oh, another one.
Can I go through the store here? Oh, I can't. Well, this is a bit of a predicament again. <laughs> Please tell me I can go through this. Okay, cool. I'm not fully stuck, which is good. I'm, you know, I'm hearing all these gunshots, and the fact. Oh, I was gonna say. Oh, they keep taking everything. Gotta search everything in this guy. He said you're gonna have a gun on him. I was gonna lay down there, but it's fine. Definitely don't need those those shells for a very long time. But <laughs> At the same time, it's kind of funny because I, I rarely ever find those things, so maybe taking them early on is kind of a sign for me. So I know this is the egg. This is the river right here. But I don't want to quite leave it. I can, I can obviously leave and get some loot from just buying it, which I may actually do, but I'm going to see if I can get anything else that's in the little area here. Oh, good. Guessing that's an exit for somebody. Oh, let's go in here. Grocery store. Let's grab a bunch of food. This so we're right next to our exit. Let's just grab all the food we can, get out with it, and then we'll be good to go back and forth into raids. This, this is at least something. I can buy like a pistol or something to go in for the next raid. You seeing inside these? Nope. <laughs> is it ideal? What, what I'm thinking right now? Probably not, but it's it's a plan. It's definitely a plan, you know. Ooh. Oh no, nope, those are just those are static. I'm still not seeing dead bodies out there. I'm only finding two items, huh? Oh nope, there's more. One, that's that's something too. So we get some ammo out of here too, which will be useful. We can sell some of the stuff too. Got some there. I can get a sailor wall as well. How about for any of those heavy bleeds? I won't have that problem like I did last raid. Push it to one more building, you think? We will attempt for just a second. It's too hairy, we're getting out. That's what he's feeling here. The shots. Yeah, it's feeling hairy. Let's go. We're gonna call it good for this raid and come back. And let's just listen to the sound. I think I, I feel like the sounds I'm are hearing are not correct. I guess they don't feel correct. Ooh, food. More food. Need that for a task anyway, so that's good. That's more money right there. I'm gonna do one more thing. 
This should be able to fit it right here. That's all I wanted to do. That will take in the armor, but I want more more bags than armor right now. Can't go in there. Oh hi! I didn't even see you there. You got a gun? No, you don't. This should be the sewer river. Aha, it is. Okay, cool. We'll get out. We'll get some 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 guns from this, hopefully. And we'll go from there. Nice, right, so we survived at least. <laughs> there's been a, there's a few sketchy moments there. Just a few. I'm, I'm sure you as you all saw. But we made it out. 1600 XP. Does that get to level 3? It does. Nice. We didn't get hit at all either, which is good. That's That was successful. I will definitely take that. Nice. Okay, we've made it out. Let's see what we can get off here. Take all this stuff out. And of course, I'll try to organize as much as I possibly can, but I'll be honest, I can't guarantee it's going to look amazing every time. Because knowing me, I'm going to be like, oh, it looks great. We'll worry about this later. And then I'll totally forget to do it. Uh, this will work for now. I'll take the commando because I honestly want to save this for later. I like this combo for the for the stuff. Uh, we can keep all the medical supplies. We do four and five. Yeah, that should be good there. Trader wise, I can't use this anyway because if we found a raid, so we'll sell those. We can sell the beans. We can sell that one for now as well. I gotta save this guy, so we'll put him down below. Um. Uh, Food wise, I'm gonna see everything else. I got 85,000. I'm gonna sell these shells for now. I, it seems that I can find them quite often, say inside that map. So we'll just uh, we'll we'll sell for now. It's not tasks I need to worry about for Kappa if I if we ever try to go for it anyway. So and we'll sell the paracord as well. 170,000. Let's take a look at crap war. Let's get ourselves SKS. I'm sure all his ammo is all bought out. So. Um, Oh, it's gear. Where's your ammo? I'm not able to buy his ammo. That would be kind of awkward if I can't buy ammo for this. I've always been able to. Why am I not able to buy the ammo now? Well, that's a turn of events that I never expected. Wait, hold on. HP runs. It's not the best, but it's something. Let's go. We'll, we'll go 60 for, for right now. It's, yeah, they're not the best uh, rounds whatsoever. But if I can get a headshot or something on them at least, it, at least it's something. It's a gun. It's a better gun than what we than we have, which is nothing. Take the ammo. We can also get ourselves a. Oh, that changed. Huh. So EWR now gets you a sale. Well, that is completely changed. Good to know. Buy a couple of these guys. I already got one bandage, but I'm gonna buy one more. And then one more of the AI ones. Uh, HP, we'll just top off on that one. All right, cool. I have a bunch of medical supplies, but that's fine. I need to carry as much as I possibly can at this point. Four, five, and six on that one. Good enough. All right. I think to finish this off, we're going to go back into streets again. Uh, just kind of see what we can get from there again and go from there. Next next episode, we'll work on the task, work on debut, get the kills and whatnot. Um, I was rushing them so fast, but I figured, you know, why not? Let's go have a little fun in the streets and see what we can find out uh, about the map and what we can learn from it. So let's head over to the streets one more time. Let's get some items and let's end this episode with a bang. Let's do this. Okay, we're in the clothing store. This is kind of cool, actually. Yeah, this actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's see what we can find. Anything inside here that we can use? 
Get some moolah from here, maybe. Hey, we can actually. Nice. Why not? Ooh, there's also a computer in here. Nice. Okay. GPU, maybe. Maybe a GPU. Oh, we got two of them. Nice. DVD drives. Someone said to me before that apparently DVD drives are pretty nice for some trades, so... I don't know if that's actually true. We'll... We'll hold on to it for right now. And uh, see where that actually goes for us. Okay. Where, oh, where can we go? The biggest thing is just figuring out which doors I can enter. I'm going to be searching for hours trying to figure that out. Because of how many there are. That is definitely not a door I can enter. Okay. See anything in there? You know, for that one. I'm guessing I can't enter in any of these buildings. That would be correct. <laughs> Alright, let's move forward. Oh, this I don't want rat. Okay, we're right at the cinema. Okay. Underpass, we got the scab checkpoint. If ever I stop and I'm looking at something, it's because I'm trying to figure out the exact this scab checkpoint is way the heck over there. Okay, so they're both pretty far away, our exits. I need to remember I'm working with freaking HP. <laughs> Not the best. I got a broken arm now, dang it. Pretty sure that was a headshot, but I guess not. Maybe I hit the top of something. How many times did I hit him? Head eyes. I hit him three out of the seven shots I hit, and most of it was over to by, uh, by armor. I'm going to say that was probably having to do with um with the HP rounds, because the HP rounds just don't have any penetration. Ah, well, as you can see, it can go from, from great to bad. <laughs> but let's talk about it for you. Is what it is, not a big deal. Uh, we still got a backpack, we still got a, a rig that we can bring those. We don't need armor, that's the only downside. We are a little bit low on money because I did end up buying a helmet for us for that run. Eh, it could be worse, it could be worse. But I still want to figure out more about that map. It's, I feel like there's a lot of loot that's able to be gained, a lot of money to be able to get from that. So let's see if we can get back up. We got 103,000 rubles still left to use. Let's see what we've got. I could buy the PP91. I would like to use this guy though. Is there any way I can get one of those now? Doesn't look like it. BPO is not the worst. It's a 762 variant too. 31,000. When we're running HP rounds, it's the only negative side of that. What about for you, Mr. Mechanic? What do you got for me? Nothing really I can use. Okay, so best bet is probably gonna be. Probably gonna go with a PPSH. One thousand. You hate to see it, but you gotta use what you can use, right? I would like to use this guy too, but we'll try it with the PP91. I said PPSH. PP91. Uh, ammo wise, let's buy what, like, hundred? The rounds should be good, pretty good on that one. Mags. I think I can only buy the small mags now. Buy three. 
Three plus the big one. I think that'd be fine. Let's get two of those. Actually, what do I have for meds? I know has, I put something in here. Okay, we got money. We can pull out this. We got a bandage. I got one of those. So we can put another two of the meds. Let's grab two of the S marches. Leaves me with something to use. Okay, let's get all this unloaded. Grab the mags, load all this up. Okay, it's something. Grab all the meds here. Four, five, five, six. Oh, I don't want to go to the hideout. Oh, crap. Uh, I want to get one more bandage, so just I like doing things in two for some reason. Two of each of the medical for right now until we can get something better. And then pretty much go from there. Let's try that one more time. Let's sell the hat. That gives us a little bit of money. Alright, well. Get rid of all that. I'm working with the scraps right now. Buy one more bandage. Take that with us. Okay. We'll work with that and see how far this gets us. Let's head back to the streets. Let's uh, jump in and see what we can make happen. Hope that doesn't uh, happen again, shall we? <laughs> so let's get going. Oh, we're next to these apartments. I think this is the ones that we got the decent loot from before. We'll see. It also seems like uh, the spawns are really close to each other, like at the beginning. So I'm going to be careful about that. Because I definitely don't like the fact that like I can run right into someone like in two seconds. Whoop. For some reason I thought that said open instead of uh, breach. Okay, here, let's go upstairs, see what kind of items we can find. <clears throat> so yeah, it seems like I just gotta be careful at the beginning and then kind of go from there. Oh, is that the parking garage down there? That may be the parking garage that we're above right now. Heard some footsteps. Alright, we got some apartments here. I'm just gonna go look at the outskirts first of it and then we'll move in. Which looks like there's nothing. Okay. Definitely just gotta move slow. Take our time through the map. Don't uh, don't rush. Seems like if we rush, we're just gonna get our butts kicked right away, especially with what we have. We only got the, the one weapon, and obviously we don't have a lot to go with it. So we're just gonna just slow it down, take our time, go through it, and learn it all. I think I need these actually. I believe, yeah, I, I think I need those for the test. So we'll, uh, we'll hold on to those. Anything else? Office here, got some lag going on. <laughs> I love, I love wipe day. Love the first wipe day, man. It's my favorite. Open this up, see what kind of stuff we can get. Now that we have a backpack and a rig, we're just gonna pretty much grab whatever we can get our hands on, at least for a little bit. Let's see anything inside this room? That. Oh, the blown out wall. Anything in the bathroom. So many doors, but loot, not so much. Okay, we definitely were in this room. Now, now that I'm looking at it, or in this building, we never went actually all the way up. So this is completely new to us. Is this is a staircase. Okay, this is the other staircase. The connection issues. Top right hand corner, if you're wondering. That's how I know. Sounds like a construction site. I really 
at the playground because I think that's the construction that I'm looking at. What was the exits anyway? I mean, I actually didn't even look at the beginning. So see, sewer river. Uh, we got the unpad. Okay, so okay, yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay, I know those two are at from this direction. We're in the in the middle of both, which is good. Let's go over to the actual basement. See if there's anything we can find. If this is the right building, I'm thinking. I'm, I'm quite certain it is. Parking garage. Yes, yes, it is. We'll search this up for a little bit, see what we can find. Let people do their thing up top, and we'll just kind of skirt down below. Take it all for now. Oh, seizure warning, by the way. You are prone to that. Look away now for a second. This is the stairs? This is not the stairs. Okay. Can I open these trunks? That was the question. Oh, I can. Nice. Can I open this? Nope. I feel like it's a missed opportunity. It'd be kind of cool if you could if you could open up the trunks and then open up like the the backpacks up in the back. Ooh, bolts. Ooh, okay, we got some stuff here. All right, we got some task stuff. I'll take it. Can't open that. I guess the way that we're pointing, I could head towards the cinema for the time being. I can't see from this angle. I know where he's at. I'm just going to just move there slowly. Shit. Got him, but that hurt. He reacted a lot faster than I thought I was going to. Ooh, we got an AK. Nice. Okay. Take all this. We got a melee now. If anything does go wrong, we now have something extra to kind of protect ourselves. mask. I could hold on these these knives obviously and get myself an MP5, but I think I'm just, I'm, I'm not gonna worry about that. Ooh. Key, 220 key. Okay, got another S March. Drop that duffel bag. We'll just transfer everything over this one. Need a shotgun round, transfer that, take that. Shotgun maybe not a bad idea, but I am not gonna worry about it for now. Alright, let's keep moving. Head to this side of the building. I think I'm in the right direction. I don't have a compass, so I'm kinda guessing. I'm quite certain though this is the, uh, the end of the building right towards the evacuation extract for us, so we'll head this way, see where we go. Yeah, I'm where I want to be, okay. Actually, there's more in here. Oh, is this the, um... Oh, wow, where's the entrance of that? Is that going to go around this way? That's confusing. Okay, I guess it's up, the entrance is on the other side. I don't know if we've actually been here or not. An off 
office. All these computers. Ooh, do I actually need a cricket for the uh, the hideout. We'll take that. Cricket lighter. Oh, it's a locked cabinet, huh? Now I'm kind of curious about that. We'll come back to this, but that's curious right there. Lock cabinet. I wonder what's going to be inside that. Okay, I feel like I'm being teased. That looks like something I could grab. Hoping to get lucky on a gas analyzer or something here. Nope, more, more items we can sell. Kitchen. Grab some food. Energy and water seem kind of eh. This is really wide open here. Not a fan of how wide open it is. Try and say a little quiet so I can hear players. That's at me or not. Sounds are kind of wonky in this map, so I'll play. I'm a little like 50 50. Do I keep pushing? Do I just wait and see if maybe they're shooting at me? Or it's a little weird. Can I go to the back of this? No. Just seems like a dangerous thing I don't want to go near, so I'm not going to touch that. <laughs> Knowing me, there's going to be like a mine or something, and I'll blow up, and I'll it's like, I told you, I told you it was a bad idea. No keys. Question is, can you go into the actual cinema? That's what I want to go look at. I know you can go like underneath it, but can you go up through the top portion of it? Oh, connection issues. Drum set. Where? I don't know where you're at. I hear you, but I don't see you. Shots to the head, he didn't die. Ah, eh, little sus. Okay, please tell me you get PS ammo. Oh, thank goodness you do have PS ammo. Thing just doesn't want to show up, apparently. Get 
That's a good old drink up. We can put this, start loading that up. Someone to my left, I just heard. <clears throat> I'm to be careful here. Not like a scam, though. I'm gonna try this. Again, I hear them. So for those that are like freaking out, chat right now, like, what are you doing? There's a guy there. I know. I know he's there. Trying to clear space, things I don't need. The subtask, get those five kills I need. How much did they give us? Actually, we're looking pretty good. Okay. Let's give a tag. Uh, when I went up top, though, I didn't see an entrance to this place, so I'm guessing no, you can't actually go in. It's just kind of you have to go around it. It would be kind of cool to be going in. Oh, maybe let's, let's go up top here. This is still the cinema up here. Headaches, big headaches with all these, all these freaking lag spikes. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Okay, I know where I'm going. We are heading towards one of the exits, which is good. I, I do want to kind of move that direction now that we have all this loot. Hoping to find a little bit more of an upgrade on armor-wise, but all good. All good indeed. We'll just kind of move forward. I think there's the building on the right here. We can do some looting. Just watching out because I like I know there's some second floors here that I gotta watch out for that someone may be looking at. But I'm, I'm also still learning it, so I don't know where we're all at. Like right there. Because there's a second floor here. Like a hotel. That's lovely. There's a power bank right there. I'm gonna unload all these mags. I can actually carry a little bit more. I know I just bought them, but I can obviously buy more, so we'll just empty these out. Can I not stack more than 20? I can. That was, that was a little funky. Drop that. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to do that. That probably ended up turning bad for me. Cricket. Maybe a pistol if I can get a pistol. Nope. I gotta say though, for design wise, I mean, I've never seen like a map in a different or in any other video game that had this much detail. So I gotta give the I gotta give the team their kudos on that because it honestly it looks great. They did such a great job with all the design. I don't think anyone could deny that. Nothing to loot in there. 
you know, it's, we all know it's going to be a little laggy and a little buggy at the beginning, but, you know, in that same stance of saying that, it did a really good job with the design. Can I exit through this? No, I can't. Let's go through the back. Like there's there's definite points of like tension you're gonna run into on this map, which I like. A lot of sharp points because there's a lot of doors you can't open up, so it's gonna lead to some interesting fights for sure. Our ice is pretty darn close. Let's see if there's any food we can take out with us. Oh, a lot more of this building. Oh, we got apartments. Okay. Don't mind if I do. What the heck is that? Oh, electronic components. Oh, that's that's new. Electronic components. That's that's new. I I was thinking. Oh, I was thinking like uh, caps that you normally would get. That is a completely different item. Yeah, let's just examine that for the XP. HP rounds, definitely don't want that. Eh. I forgot you have to pick it up to get the XP. No, drop it. US ammo. Definitely need to see if I can get my hands on more of the uh try to get my hands on more of the items, so like for like eight like uh P uh what do you call it? I'm literally thinking the name already. Yes ammo. <laughs> we need to get a lot more of that. Do we need any bleach? Can I have the dinosaur? I'll take the dinosaur instead. If that's an option, please. Take it for now. It's something. I already checked. Oh, there's ammo right there. I missed. PRS. Nothing in the bathroom. Especially with Lighthouse. When they when they when they did the Lighthouse map, there were so many small spots you could get loot from. I just want to make sure I'm checking everything. There's actually a back alley I didn't know about here, so I do want to check that too. I can open that door. Guessing I can... No, I can't go out here. But there are cabinets here, so I'm going to check out some guess I'm there's some keys. Money. Tech manual, huh? I have a feeling I'll find more of those in the future. <laughs> For now, I'm not going to take it. Just see if there's anything useless that I have on me that I don't really want to take. A broken G4, need one of those for sure. Anything else you got for us? I think that's it. I think that's everything in here. Bathroom, nothing. I haven't found anything good in bathrooms yet. I don't see a way to get to that back yard. I think I have to go the other direction if I want to go back to that. But honestly, for all the loot we got right now... Oh, wait, hold on. That's right. I don't think there's anything I can really do here. Just check these sides here. What in time's going on over there? <laughs> All right, we're gonna we're gonna call it good. I got enough items on me. I only left like one space open anyway. Actually, no, I I don't have any spaces open. Let's take the sewer river and get the heck out of here. Not bad. Not bad at all. We had those unfortunate deaths, but hey, that's how Tarkov goes. But we ended up getting out some decent stuff. I'm happy with it. That's a win in my book right there. Definitely a win in my book. Get some pretty good XP from that. I want to say... Because we killed a couple of scabs. 3,800. 3, no players, but we got five scab kills. Very cool. Very cool. I'm happy with that. We'll get ourselves fully meted up. Not bad overall. 
that was uh, that was a good haul. I still want to see what this is going to go to. These uh, electronic components. We shall see very soon, I'm sure. Get all this stuff pulled off. Uh, I'm actually okay. I'm going to use the ADR for the next couple of raids. See how far we can go with that. We definitely got some nice items started. Some items we can sell. Looking good indeed. And we get enough, another uh, rig as well, which will be nice in case we lose the one we have currently. We'll see how that goes, of course. Anything else I got? No, I think that's good enough. All right. I think, honestly, that is a pretty good start for us. Um, not the best start I've ever had, but hey. The whole point of this uh, this beginning here for Season 8 was to go and explore uh, the streets of Tarkov because I've been wanting for forever to play this map and it's finally here and we get to have an enjoyable time with it. Actually, how many players is even on streets? I never actually even looked at that. 15 to 17. Yeah, it's a bit of a bump. <laughs> a little bit of a bump from, from other maps, so that's, that's pretty awesome. I like the fact that there's more players, but... We got a lot to come coming up for this season, ladies and gentlemen. A lot of exciting things I'm sure we're going to run into, especially when more people get to learn the streets of Tarkov and see how people are going to end up playing it. Uh, the dynamics that can happen, I think we're going to have a, a nice twist, a nice twist to the season. So, a lot to come, a lot to work towards. Next episode, we are definitely going to be starting to work on our tasks. We're going to head over to customs, get the shotgun kills, or, or the, no, the shotguns that we need to find. Actually, what do we all need to do? Actually, we beat. We already got this. We don't technically need to go there for the shotguns. We need to find the sale was, and we need to go to woods for sure. We need to get the letter so we can get Jaeger unlocked. I would like to get that done all by next episode, and I think we can do it. Especially we're doing our episodes, and obviously we're going way over today, which is completely fine because, well, I'm having fun with Street so far, and I want to explore as much as possible. So, a lot to come in the future, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, someone asked me before in, 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 a, in a, the most recent video that was a long time ago that what was my goal for this upcoming year for subs, subscribers. Uh, we're still shooting for 100,000. I think we can make it happen. We're going to push for it. 2023 is going to be an interesting year for sure indeed. And Tarkov is definitely going to have some things in store for us. So with that being said, we're going to definitely end the episode here and we're going to get ready for the next one. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you give a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you have yet to hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit subscribe. You ding that notification bell. And ladies and gentlemen, Season 8 has just begun and I hope you're ready. I'll see you in the next one.